What's up, bitches? Panic well, Knife here. AwfulGamer.com. This, this is The Walking Dead Bad Motherfucker, Episode 3. So, we've just left Herschel's farm because uh, Kenny is an asshole and just took his son and ran. Even though I was kind of hoping, uh, but like I said, I, I've made this decision before. So, I was hoping that uh, Duck gets his ass killed because he's fucking annoying, but he doesn't. He's just going to stand there and continue to be annoying. Walkers all over the place. Hey yeah, just keep you yell out, you know. No Trucks big deal. I'm sure the walkers aren't going to come and try to eat you. Fuck! Yeah, fuck. I mean, seriously, you're in the middle of a zombie apocalypse and you're going to yell and be like, Hey, there's a guy just fixing his car. No big deal. <laughs> I just shot, just shot the, uh, the zombie right on top of him. Yeah, no big deal. Alright. And Glenn! It's Glenn! Spoiler alert, not gonna to open up again. No big deal! Can't take risks like this. And we can't just let people die either. You got a when real I strong jawline, sister. Stay shut no matter what. I fucking mean it. We <laughs> don't know who these people are. They could be dangerous. Yeah. I, maybe I am Watch. dangerous, baby. Maybe I am dangerous. Us. Where the hell is your humanity? Whoa, chill the fuck out. <laughs> We're just people trying to avoid those things. Just like you. Yeah, Don't chill the here. fuck swear out. Me. No, I will Say swear at you, bitch. You start threatening these people. You'll have to excuse her. The hell he or anyone will. This maybe I'm going to end up pissing survival. off Lily in this. Can you guys <laughs> not see what's happening? We can see what's happening. What is it? I, I have to pee. I'd go out there again in a second. In a minute, Clem. <laughs> yeah, don't. They've got kids, be here. really. Those things outside don't care. Maybe you should go join him then. You'll have something in common. God nah. damn it, Lily. You have to control these people. She's an asshole, that's for sure. That's what it takes. <laughs> well, you don't have to be a bitch about it. <laughs> Holy shit. Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. Fuck you. He wasn't bitten. Hell, he wasn't. I will we have bite to you, bitch. Now, over my dead body, we'll dig one hole. No, I'm cleaning him up. There's <laughs> kind of no bite. I'm not gonna lie. He's fine. Don't you fucking people get it? We've already seen this happen. We let someone with a bite stay in, and we all end up bitten. Shut up. Really? You all ended up bitten because you're fucking alive now, Kenny, dick. Stop it! Maybe we're gonna have to what beat his ass. Guy? Establish dominance. Dad, it's just a boy. It, it... We kick his ass. That's <laughs> what I'm thinking. Everyone, chill the fuck out. Nobody's <laughs> doing anything. Shut no, no, up, I will. Boy. I'll kick it. I'll kick everyone's shut ass. The fuck up. They will find us, and they will get they in will here, find us, and none and of this will, will fucking us. matter. But right now, we're about to be trapped in here with one of those things. Nope, you're not. What the hell are you talking about? He's bitten. That's how you turn. He's not bitten. Please stop this. It's upsetting him. Oh, well, he's a dumb kid I'm anyway. Upsetting him. <laughs> upsetting is getting eaten alive. Sit down. See it. Oh, You're gonna shit. Whoop me? <laughs> you yes. and what homo parade? <laughs> this one. <laughs> I kind of like him. He's kind of funny. But I'm still going to threaten him. Before you eat your mommy, you can watch your dad get his nose broken. I'm going to kill him, cat. Just worry about Can we just dunk. kill him early? That'd be pretty me? awesome, actually. Yeah? There's someone in there. It's just locked. Keys behind the counter. Probably. That's probably not the best advice. Hey, I'm not the just bad saying. guy here. You don't just really want to open locked daughter. doors in this no, environment. You're just the guy right. arguing for killing a kid. He's covered in muck. She'll find the bite. Watch. She won't. And if she does, then you deal with it. First thing he'll do is sink his teeth into his mom's face. Hopefully it sinks then, it into your face. When she's dead, he'll probably pounce on your little girl. Then we deal with it then. But right now we're just freaking everybody out. And get ready to deal with it because that boy is bit. Not gonna happen. It is. And we're tossing <laughs> him out now. I bet we're tossed you out now, motherfucker. Knock this guy out happily. Jesus. <laughs> oh man. Nice. Starting fist fights. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> I guess we gotta fist fight this fucking zombie. <laughs> like I said, my my ammo here is that I am actually <laughs> second. I'm trying, although I just tripped right now. Dude, my guy cannot walk. I don't know what is up with this. Yeah, punch that fucking zombie. Oh my god, I'm trying to keep as fast as I can and I couldn't keep it off me. 
Thanks, Carly. Man. Carly's kind of smoking hot, too. Not really. She might have a big jaw, but... You okay? She's about as good as it gets in this game. Just great, thanks. Glenn's like, I don't guys. like you guys being assholes. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of zombies out there. I pretty much keep shooting bullets, you stupid. The uh, general zombie theory is that they are attracted to noise, so great idea to continue to make noise, right? I like the idea. There are lots of guns out there, though. I don't know. Thank God for whatever it is. We almost died because of this. I thought the military was kind of gone, although this is closer to the um, the zombie apocalypse period than the TV show is, so. I guess there, there's a potential that the military is. Was he the one bitten? <laughs> no, don't be crazy. No. It's Maybe he's heart. bitten. Let's shoot him. Pills. Um, nitroglycerin pills? Yes, we're out. We've been trying to get into the pharmacy since we got here. Please try to get in there, behind the counter where the pills are. Why don't I just fucking kill the door? There's probably another entrance. Maybe through the office. How do you know that's an office? Uh, educated guess. It doesn't matter. We need yeah, Carly's on to something. Pills. Please get in there. Why would I'll I save his ass when he just wanted to fucking kill Everyone me? Everyone else Seriously? should get comfy and look for anything yeah. useful. We could That's be nice. in here a while. I'm starting to think this drugstore isn't a permanent solution. It's You're a pretty right. good solution, honestly. This ain't exactly Fort Knox. Look at what that. You suggest? We need as much gas as possible so we can all get out of downtown Macon. Fast. Agreed. And I'll head out and get gas. Yeah, There's Glenn's gonna go do shit. Crazy I'll shit. That's what he does. I'll work my way towards it, and then loop back, siphoning what I can. What are you gonna carry it in, dummy? Damn, that'd be great. Well, it's gotta huh, get done. Sounds good. Plus, I'm quick. I'm not gonna stop you, buddy. Lincoln. Local? Born and raised. If you're gonna do that, here's a walkie-talkie if you get in a tight spot. Hopefully, you won't need it. Maybe he's cool. not going very Clinton far, but I don't think walkie-talkies really have that big of a range, as as generally. Can. And you? What's your name? It's Lily. My dad's Larry. Keep a, a good eye on him. These boys will work on getting you your medicine. That's right. And you, you keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug Carly when he needs wants it. A little For bit now, of Doug. get some rest. You're a good shot, and I'd like to keep it that way. You got it, boss. Now get him those pills. Um, okay. So I gotta look around and do Central shit. Central High Tech State. Good times. Papers a week old. Feels like years. Talk to Carly. Hey, Carly. How you doing? You're a pretty good shot. Well, you don't fuck with a reporter. Especially one that's three days out from her last cup of coffee. <laughs> um, let's see. You seem to handle yourself pretty well. Yeah, really? Matter. I'm a disaster. Yeah, buddy. Yeah. My yeah. news editor was eaten about five Ooh, yeah. feet away from me, and I would have joined her if it wasn't for that dorky guy on watch over there. Oh. I'm sorry. She was an asshole. That explains but, things. You know. Yeah. Things you haven't seen yet. Shit. That guy saved you? <laughs> yeah. Can you believe it? Those creeps, or, or ghouls, or whatever the hell they are, they were pulling our van apart, and that guy, Doug, just came to the rescue. Sounds fishy to me. You never tell who the heroic you need to stick by me, baby. He's kind of cute. I'm big and fucking parents strong. parents' basement bitch. sort of way. Huh? Huh? Oh, uh, nothing. <laughs> How'd you end up here? We drove up to cover the Cherry Blossom Festival. Real hard-hitting stuff. In so Macon, Georgia, they have a Cherry Blossom Festival? Weird. What are you messing around with there? A radio. I can't get it to work, though. Here. Let me have a look. This is probably one of the funniest scenes I've seen. Look at this. Alright, let's flip it over. Oh! Shocker, There's the no chick doesn't know how to put batteries in the fucking thing. You know so, that there are no batteries in now I get to go through the yeah, uh, of course. mission I mean, yeah. of walking around no. and trying to find try batteries to find for her. Beats too. Thanks. I wouldn't even really know what to look for. She's a reporter and she doesn't know how to, you know, look for batteries. That's not inconsistent. No big deal at all. Let's give Clementine food. It's not much, but here you go. Thank you. Of course. Of course I took care of Clementine. She's my girl, man. Pick up as many energy bars as I can get. Just because I think that it might help us out in future episodes. Hint, hint. 
I think I took one last time, and this time I think I'm gonna take them all. That's how I roll. Selfish. Selfish knife. Um, Dr. Lily, no. Open office, no. I, I, I've gotta find these batteries. I forget where they're at. Take energy bar, all right. Keep doing that. And we can't I'm not let anything happen Fuck to that Ducky. Kid. That kid's annoying. There's a battery. Look at that. Woot. I'm good at this battery finding shit, man. Just walking around in circles. Newspaper. There's one on the floor over here, I remember. I think I got it. Yeah, there it is. Okay. So, looks good, looks good. I'm going to have to put together this radio for this bitch because she doesn't understand how to put it together. <laughs> This All right. battery should fit the radio. Great, thanks. Do I have to click it twice? And really? here's another one. Okay. <laughs> should be able to get it to work now. Let's talk to Carly. Hey, Carly. It's still not working? Yeah, I can't figure it out. Let me have a look at that thing. This is so stereotypically misogynist, it's kind of funny. Watch this. Flip it over. Look at the battery she put in. Oh, right. She put them in backwards. <laughs> Sweetheart, seriously. It just t it tells you right there how to put them in. And yet, no. Fail. And flip it back over. Oh, you know what? I got to turn the antenna. Sorry. Put the antenna up first. And then flip it over. And voila, it works. You fixed it. Of course I did, baby. I know, electronics. It's kind of cool, like, environment shit here. The station is okay. In the event of a full... Uh, my, my producer's telling me we have to get off the air. Steve. Helps set the environment nice, I like it. God bless you all. Damn. Heard or seen anything? Kind of scary. Nothing, luckily. Wanna step outside, have a look around? Yeah, that seems like a I'm not good suicidal uh, yet. Decision. No, the gate out there is closed. We can hang out in front of the store and be fine. Oh. Huh. <laughs> this is a great plan. Sure. Let's go have a look around. Cool. And we'll keep it down. Don't need to bring him back this way with any unnecessary noises. Agreed. Ooh, yeah, agreed. This plan is so flawed in like every way. Just throwing this out there. You'll see as it develops, but it's so freaking flawed. So are we led to believe that that's like a fresh kill? Because who is it? Just eat. As far as I can tell, that's all they care about. And if one gets you, well, I don't think they actually care about things. And whatever's left comes back as one of them. I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. Yeah, I think so too. We better keep it down out of here. <laughs> yeah, don't be fucking gabbing all over the place. Look at the one trapped over there. Better hear uh, this. Huh? Uh, uh, oh, ooh. Oh shit. It's what? his brother. Do you know that guy? Kind of, he has a familiar face. <laughs> oh, you're from around here, huh? Could be anybody, you know. I, I just want to admit it, man. And get all cheap like, up and yeah, bitch. Shut up, dog. I own this joint. Look at the uniform, though. He could have worked at the drugstore and died with keys in his pocket. <laughs> hint, hint. <laughs> take a lot of effort to make it safe enough to go out there and see if he has the keys. If we could somehow prove that he worked here, I think it'd be worth it. How about the fucking uniform? I can find. Ugh. Dumbass. I can't reach that brick. Can't reach the brick. Yeah, Order up window. Fortification job over there. TV. Yeah, it didn't work. <laughs> Too bad we don't have a way to come out here and watch the news. <laughs> As if the news now. stations are just going to be sitting there broadcasting. Wait, isn't the reporter back there inside? Anyway. 
I'm going back in. Let's head back inside. Okay. And I think I'm going to go into the office. See how that rolls. Try to bust my way through the door. I mean, why not just try to bust your way in, right? Just open the door. Okay, there you go. <laughs> This is a pretty nice uh, sleeping accommodations with the blood all over the floor and everything. I can't. I can't think about them in here. <laughs> Don't slip on the blood like you always do. There's a photo over there. There you go. Look. Proves he works here. So can we please just run the fuck outside? <laughs> And it's a picture of me. Aw, how sweet. Why would I rip it off? I don't know. I guess we'll see. Find anything? Yeah, of course. Of course, a sneaky reporter bitch catches me in the act. It's a photo of the family who owned this place. Might help us track down the keys to the office. I know who you are. You're Lee Everett. You're a professor at Athens who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. Fuck you. This is your parents' story. Totally not true. Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. <laughs> I paid attention to that trial. Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. <laughs> Did you tell anyone Murder? out there who you were or that you were tied to this place? Sounds good. No. I've been sticking to first names for a reason. I don't know. I think, like I said, I think you we should just like come out okay and say guy. it. But and the last thing we me. need is drama out there. You've got this little girl to take care of, and look, don't make me wrong on this. I don't plan to. Ooh, yeah. Good. Step because if this Step lasts longer her, than baby. a few days, and you're a detriment to the group, then we'd have a problem. Yeah, because you're falling in love with me. I'll just keep it to myself. Oh yeah, keep it to yourself. Thanks. Don't worry about it. She remembers that I trust her. All right. All right, so move the pallet. Why would they throw all the shit against the door? Is it? I don't know. It's stupid. It's like they're guarding against uh, something going What's into that, that door, except the problem is that this there is doesn't appear to be anything behind there. He's so, up around here on it from time to time. Uh, was he sick? Nah, he was okay. I actually saw him whoop shoplifters with it. <laughs> this cane's protected this place better than any guard dog ever could. Plus, he knew how to make it look cool. Like you with your hat. My dad gave it to me. See, dad just So sweet. Like Alright, so let's push this desk out of the way. I ought to clear a path to opening that door. Better get this door clear, huh? Yeah. Can I help? Of course you can. Sure. Cause it's Here like a go. two pound desk. <laughs> it's like Ikea. How are you doing? Yeah, it's not that heavy. <laughs> How about with everything outside? It's not good. No, it's not. But I think it'll be okay. Of course it will. Cause you okay. got me, baby. Here we go. <laughs> it's not that heavy, and yet she's grunting against the, de the desk. Do you have kids? Nope. No. You don't have a family? Let's just move this thing. <laughs> oh. Okay. I'm sorry. It's fine. All it's like, right. I don't really want to tell Clementine that I axe murdered his wife or my <laughs> wife, but no big deal. Although I, I feel like there's no real harm. Why in don't you want to talk about your family? The, Do they like hate you? You know, the, his family owns this place. Because they're dead. Oh, I'm sorry. You didn't know. I'm just sorry for being mean. <laughs> yeah, you better be sorry Look, for being mean. Family's gone I'm about to be mean to everybody. Yeah. 
I, um, I, I got into a fight once. <laughs> and what That's happened? That's one way to put it. And it ended really badly. After that, I wasn't allowed to talk to my family. That's so sad. Let's move this thing. Yeah, let's just stop talking about me murdering people. Although, I'll, that's all I want to do to other people. And yet, I have to talk to the okay? chick about it. I or the girl about it. It doesn't make Is any it sense. Bleeding? A little. This is such a sweet, tender moment. I'll find you a bandage. And it has no zombies at all in it. <laughs> Alright, search first aid kit. That's probably the best place to find a bandage. And I'm guessing this isn't a zombie bite, and therefore, I think we'll be okay. Let's have a look at that finger. Ow. It hurt. Of course it did. Let's it's see a if cut. We can do something about Sweetheart. It. And, uh, let's bandage that shit up. Let's get this cut covered up. Yes, please. Anyway. I think this is going to be where we end this episode. Uh, this is sort of a transition episode where we get into the, uh, the, the situation where we're going to progress the story forward. Anyway, hope you guys have enjoyed Me? the series so far, yeah. and uh, we'll continue to do it. What if my parents come home anyway, and I'm not there? With the awfulgamer.com. It's your boy, Panic Knife. Hope you guys enjoyed this, the this video, I guess. And uh, 